You can use Microsoft Whiteboard for collaborative tasks between staff or students. Here are three useful tools for this, including a new update feature for tasks. List is a useful tool to provide tasks which need to be completed. To add a list, click on the insert menu icon on the toolbar and then select list. You can now add tasks by typing into each row. You can customise each list by selecting it. For example, you can change the bullet points into tick boxes. You can sort the tasks by number of likes or in alphabetical order. The title for the list can also be edited. I found lists useful to provide instructions to students and to quickly provide feedback by using the like button to indicate to the students I have checked and confirmed they have completed the task. Note grids are useful to display sticky notes in an organised manner. To add one, select note grid from the insert menu in the toolbar. To add sticky notes, select Add Note. You can then customise each sticky note. For example, you can sort by colour, alphabetical order or like reaction count. You can also add a title to the grid. Microsoft have added a new feature to help with collaboration called Follow-up List. This will provide a template for adding tasks and assigning them to individuals, which is perfect for group projects. To add one, select Follow-up List from the Insert menu. You can now add all your tasks to this list. After typing the tasks, they can be assigned to individuals by clicking on the Assign button. This will now list all the individuals who have access to the whiteboard and you can then select the individual you wish to assign the task to. Click on one of these to continue to enhance your teaching and learning further and subscribe to the Teach Me channel so you know when more useful videos are released.